Welcome back guys, this is Henry1502 Inc. I'm back and we are continuing JavaScript from Code Academy. And this is pretty much a program that they want us to build rock, paper, scissors. And a lot of people have been struggling and they are in desperate need of a guidance of a clear light and I'm here to fill that void. Now section one is much simpler than section two but we're still going to um, work on it just for any of you guys who may be stuck on it. Now um, what I want to say is this rock paper scissors application it pretty much uses the basic things concepts that we've learned and learned we we use prompts we use if statements and we pretty much get into this new feature where we're importing a function math dot random number or math dot random whatever you want to call it um I'm, I think I'm getting it mixed up with Python right now but you guys will see it for right now just press run and we get the green check mark at the beginning we have to create a variable called user choice and we have to make a prompt turned out I was doing this well I was doing this I wouldn't say wrong well maybe wrong but it still worked for me I was doing this in a weird way as opposed to everyone else and I really didn't have a problem but like everyone else's looked so different than mine that I just decided to switch I still got the check marks which was weird um that's pretty much the thing with code you can write it in different ways and it could still be this um the correct way um it might not be the proper way but it still could be correct um so for number three all it's asking us to do is to create a variable called computer choice and it's we're going to import um, math.random so make sure math is lowercase dot oh, make sure math is uppercase the M I knew I got that right Um, and you want to generally print out on the console computer choice so let me tell you what's going on right now we created this variable this is for the user to, in, um, to input whatever they want to do rock paper or scissors over here we created a variable called computer choice so after the user submits what they want to do, computer choice gets pulled up. And the way that the computer is going to decide what it wants to do will pretty much be determined by random numbers. If random numbers are a specific algorithm, don't get worried. Don't get pulled into those. Um, so let's say if a, what we're going to do is we're going to manipulate these numbers to basically tell the computer if you get this number then you will choose rock if you get this number then you will choose paper or scissors and so on through if statements so just press run for right now and you'll just see the numbers you'll just see a number like right here it's 0.67 that's weird um so I think 0.67 would be paper or scissors I don't know if you press run again you'll get a different number 0.28 and if you press run again it just changes um, over here is the real part where we start manipulating everything and laying down the groundwork okay so here's what we want to do um, let's let's hope that I do this correctly the first attempt if computer choice I th oh I don't think I'm doing it right no I didn't do it right <laughs> um, I still didn't do it well maybe I did it right but I didn't put a number in 
Um, if computer choice is somewhere around 0.33, yeah, I did it wrong the first time. Come on, make up your mind, you bipolar. Oh, I know. Curly braces. Do this. If computer choice is less than 0.33 percent we are going to log out what are we going to log out rock Put a zero there, and there we go. Um, if else basically means if this isn't correct, then this must be. So, whoops, whoops, I am messing up all over the place. So it's basically saying that. Let me just copy this. Um, go back and change these things really quick. And computer choice. And the next thing we're just going to finish it off with an else statement. Um, so let's see. Console.log scissors. So, let me just break it down for you guys. What we did here is we created a variable which prompts us to choose rock, paper, or scissors. We created a variable for the computer choice which uses, which depending, um, depending on the number that it randomly generates, it will decide whether or not it will choose rock, paper, or scissors. So if it's if the number is under 0.33, if it's 0.33 or less, it will choose rock. If the number is over 0.33 but less than 0.67, That's weird. I made it less than. Um, I should be right. 
but less than 0.66, it will choose paper. And if anything else is chosen, then it will choose scissors. There we go. We know that it chose rock because rock is, I mean, because, oh no, it didn't choose rock. 0.99 means it chose scissors, but you don't get scissors over here. You get a false um, confirmation. The next section is really where we start adding um, all the content that you'll see later on. So. Add, like, subscribe. This is Henry1502 Inc. Comment below. I'm out.